We are back. <laughs> and we are listening to a very, very beautiful love story, man. You know, I, I like the part that you, you, you were sitting at, on his chair, sitting at his spot. I'm in the spot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, but, thinking, I'm thinking one of these days I'll just turn into a movie. Yeah. It, I think it's beautiful. It's, it's a very beautiful story yeah. we have. Yeah. I can play my own part. Yeah, <laughs> as yourself. I just herself. Will never be shocked. <laughs> <laughs> Playing next to her, it's never going to be shocked. So, so you go that far back. At yeah. what time did he start becoming Van, making movies and that whole oh, showbiz no, aspect? It didn't start till about three, four years after. Really? Right. No, actually, okay. Let's, this is how it's. I, I saw the. Um, I saw an advert mm. in in the papers. Yeah for presenters and, and I think TV3 was just coming out then. Okay. So they needed stuff and I told him about it. Mm -hmm. And so I, I think I, I pulled that page out yeah. or something and I gave it to him and he went for the audition and, and, that was, and so he started working and okay. that's um, okay. how he started. But when he started working, he was working behind the scenes. So nobody even knew him then. Mm. And um, I think af after that, I went, I went, I went to take then I went to do uh, the pageant right. before you started moving. She didn't miss Lux Universe. A long time ago. 19 what? I don't even remember. 19, <laughs> 1998, 99 I think. or something. 99, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and then, but he, he still didn't have, you didn't have a break on radio or TV. No. You were still behind the scenes right. still. I, 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 early 2000s. If you say, when did I become Van, locally, I would say um, when I started doing hits video, Mm. which was 1999 mm, mm, and mm. then I went on to do radio at Vibe FM and then Groove FM and then move on to Metro in 2000 mm. and then uh, the brand started, started around the, brand, the time the brand yeah, started the Vic, in 99 yeah, yeah. there about yeah. but by 2002 it went up another notch when I started doing Sun City the mm. television series mm -hmm. and then in another two years which is 2004 it went up another notch when i started doing the uh, uh, movies okay so between 94 and 2004 10 years yeah wow wow <laughs> and then that, so i became the household name yeah you three, became the brand yeah. Yeah, it was 2010 years and we just got married a year before. Before. Yeah. Mm. In 2003. Mm. And how was he? Was he still the van you knew? Or as he became famous and was building his brand, he was developing some new airs about him? Or was he still down no, to it? No, no. He's always been um, very practical and very much himself. But then again, I'm, I'm, I'm always pinching him to remind him <laughs> that even <laughs> before you became Van, I knew you. <laughs> you know, what, what, so. what, what occasion is it? What happens for you to remind him? <laughs> when the groupies come on, sometimes I need to remind him that hey. uh, me to I did. Yeah. So, <laughs> you know, before, they came. before they came, I was here. <laughs> and, you know, so you, I just, I think, he's, I think, but I think he's very grounded. For that, I can, I can say that he's very mm -hmm. much himself mm -hmm. and very grounded and he's he's different from the people the the people what people know him okay or what people okay. think he is yeah. you know yeah. so that really? is the part that i know mm. and so i think so the groupies don't can, bother you it's not like you get frustrated or intimidated well, i don't know what the word is no, no i don't think so i the, think i've got too much sass to be bothered <laughs> by. but um, you, you need to you, you're, you need to have nerves as hard as steel, you know, or yeah. you, you just need to, you need to understand that it's his job. Mm. I think for mm. me that's, mm. You, mm. because you have to be ready to deal with all the indignities that come with it, mm. but really it's his job. Yeah. And really, when the money comes, I'm the first person to hold it and talk. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't really complain. <laughs> <money. laughs> so I can't really. Uh, um, have, you, have, you, have you seen him in a very solid kissing scene that's like really? I think for my for my own sanity, I don't watch it. You don't watch it. <laughs> <laughs> really? I don't watch his movie. So you won't watch a movie at all, or when does that? You don't watch the scene. I watch, watch him. I when on when he tells me this this one is a good one. So watch it. By good, I mean there were no romantic scenes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? Then, then I was watching, but otherwise... But um, you haven't seen him in any romantic scene? You I, 
initially, I, um, I wasn't watching it, but I used to get uh, feedback from friends and, you know, telling me, hey, this movie that Van did. So we, we kind of had an agreement. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, pause before you say that. Let me just, <laughs> let me just finish that a little bit. Um, she gets feedback from friends, and they'll be like, ah, there's this movie I watched. The way the girl was kissing Van. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not the way Van was kissing her. The way the There's girl was kissing her. <laughs> okay, yeah. go on. So we had, we had this agreement that, okay, so if you get a script that has such scenes in it, then it's you let me know about it. Okay. So at least I'm prepared for it. Okay. And then we actually find ways to go around it so that it doesn't look too... Explicit. Explicit. Okay. And bad for me mm. because I'm sure he will probably be enjoying it. But I'm the <laughs> one who's going to. <laughs> Van, do you? I'm being a professional. <laughs> <laughs> do you professionally enjoy it? As that character, yes. As, a, <laughs> as that character. Yeah. As, Not as, as Van, Van, no. no. <laughs> yeah, so, so that's our, um, mm. our arrangement. Mm -hmm. And so far, I haven't heard anything that's going to like make me. Yeah. Kill over or mm -hmm. kill him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I guess he's what what role will you absolutely not want him not not let him do? Naked. Naked? No. Mm. No, I've never done that. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't think even personally I would do anything like that. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah. uh, I, I'm I'm not sure if 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 Hollywood comes knocking and and <laughs> and the, and, and the right. check is good. <laughs> and I'm sure she give the approval. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's, I also wanted to find out, you know, how, how those married to, you know, and he's, he's also known as a honk as well, you know, yeah. because like a honk is like a sex symbol, you know, yeah. and, and how the other partner deals with it. Yes, that's cool. usually the first question people ask me mm -hmm. when they hear my surname. So they ask me, so how do you feel when your husband yeah. is kissing? Yeah. I said, how do you feel when your husband goes to work? <laughs> <laughs> he's going to work. It's his job. So. He's just going to work. Yeah, he's going to work. So. <laughs> yeah, but it's, um, the good thing is that at the end of the day, it's me he comes home to. Yeah. But, show some love, man. Show some love. Show some. But um, it's like a perfect match, man, because for the kind of work that you're doing and for that kind of attitude and acceptance of the work, I, I, I really respect it. What, what, what are the two, three <coughs> things, I call them the charm factors, that have hooked you to her? I'm thinking. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> One, the eyes caught me. I, that's physically, yeah. which has been something, I don't know, for some reason, when I was a little boy, I always told myself I would get married to a Chinese lady. Oh, really? Yeah. I told and this was that. as close as you could get? Ah, that was as close as I could get. So, um, other than that, I think um, Ajo is very, she, she's, I, I, sum it all up, I think she's a superwoman to me. Mm. Yeah, because mm. she, she, she's helped me in so many different ways, making good decisions. I've made some decisions and she turned it around the other way and then later on I realized, ah, if I had gone the other way it would have been disastrous. So I think she's been a, a pillar to me. Mm. Uh, mm. Knowing her from uh, this teenager, and we've come so far, she's, she's more than a friend. She, mm. She's like my everything. I mean, I, I've heard of, uh, uh, some friends say a few times, um, Van, you don't go anywhere. Mm. You, you mm. don't hang out much. Yeah, yeah. You, you're always at home. <clears throat> and it, it can be positive, it can be negative. But like she said, I, I value family life so much. Fantastic. That doesn't mean I don't have friends, friends outside. Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. But she's a, she's a, she's this person who is so strong, and uh, knowing what she, she knows what she wants, mm. and she just keeps you in check without you even knowing you are being checked. You're being checked. <laughs> <laughs> you know. And, yeah. and I think it's, it's, it's beautiful. Fantastic. And, and, I, and I, I, if you take me, how many years? 22 years back, 23 years back, yeah. I, I will still want to meet her again. Wow. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa. And, and what, what, what was the charm factor for you? Uh, when I knew Van, he was nobody. 
he didn't have anything. But the little that he had, he would give it to you. He mm. would share with you. Mm. And that generosity, mm. I think, was what attracted, attracted me. Yeah. Yes, because wow. it didn't matter whether he didn't have it. He would, give it to he you. would just give it to you. And, so I, I, and for me, it was like, okay, so if this person had little and would share, then obviously when he has a lot. And to date, I just have to say it, and he says, we get it. And I'm the one who's always pinching money. I'm like, no, 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 you know, we have to do this. And I say, he said, yeah, but if you need it, just get it. You know, so it's, it's just that generous mm, mm, person. And mm. he's generous mat material-wise. He's generous with his heart. Mm, wow. he, he just gives it. That's loaded, man. <laughs> he just gives it. Yeah. That's loaded. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. wow, wow, wow. So, um... What kind of father is he? Oh, he's the cool dad. Cool dad. Yes, yeah. that's the, the one that the kids want to okay. hang with. I'm the, I'm the what, what do they say? I'm not nasty mom, I'm not nice. <laughs> I'm, yes, but, but he's the one that, you know, he, but for him, the only thing that will get him screaming is when he comes and your room is dirty or mm. if the house is dirty. That really? is the only thing that will get him screaming. But otherwise, anything else the kids want, they, they get. get. Wow. I mean, they walk over him like that. <laughs> <laughs> and the, the kids are smart, you know. They study you they yeah. and they know you. They profile you. Oh, yes. My so they know one, where to go uh, for whatever. Yeah, exactly. You know. <laughs> and what, what, what kind of a mother is he? I, I think she's a mom and a dad. Oh, okay. Yes. <laughs> to, to sum it up, mm -hmm. she can play both roles easily. She, she knows when to tell you no. Mm. Mm. and even how to say the no. Mm. There's a difference. There's a no and get yeah. out. Yeah. You know, but tries to convince you why it should be a no. Mm. So get you she, to understand. She, yes, to understand this is why, why it's, it's no. a no. And just not a no and go home. Tells you is a no and why I'm saying is a no. She, she's patient, a very uh, patient mother. Um, she, she would try to get you excited mm -hmm. when she thinks this is the time. You know, Adria is calculative. Hey. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> she plans. Everything is on plan. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> she plans. <laughs> so if you come with her with a problem, first thing she tells you is she listens to your problem. And the first thing she tells you is, so what's the solution? Hmm. Yeah, tell them. Do you don't, have don't, a solution? Don't come to me with a problem without a solution. Without a solution. Do At you least have a, yeah. give me the problem, give me the solution, solution. and then I will make my decision yeah. if I'm going to go with you or so not. Very so analytical. That always, that always wow. happens. So, yeah. She wow. will analyze every situation for you. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And, and I think that's the kind of mother she is. <laughs> but, <laughs> but you must have a solution. Yeah. You have to have a solution. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. That's what I like. Very wow. Wow. No, I, I'm enjoying this, you know. I'm enjoying this because it's... It's great to see and you guys how long because when we went out for 10 years mm. and we were married 13 years this year really? Really? so 23 oh, years that's in fantastic. October. hey <laughs> before I've, I've met my wife has been 23 years and like yeah like how that. old are you dude? i know <laughs> old i know you? You, you look 24 23 <laughs> or something. 23 24 you know and the thing about 22 years yeah. ago we met Wow. You know? Wow. And so we were, we were 17 at the time, right? I'm, I'm 40. I was 40 a few days ago. Yeah. So you do the math. We were 17. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And we both turned, she turned 40 already. I'll be 40 in August. Yeah. Wow. So we've, we practically spent more than half of our lives together. Together, yeah, than before we met. More That's than half. True. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Show them to love, man. <laughs> Oh, this has, been, this has been great, man. And for those of you watching, this is how it should be, you know? <laughs> this is how it should be. The very, very last. Why is it not like that in many, many situations? Why do you think? I think it's because when people get married, they lose themselves. Mm, mm. You know, I, for, Van allows me to be myself. Mm. He's not usually the outgoing type, mm. but I am. And mm. he doesn't stop me. Mm. So I have my life, he has his life, and then we have our life. Hmm. You know, wow. so you don't get lost in each other such hmm. that when the other person slips, then you are found wanting, hmm. you know, hmm. so that, that I think is what. Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, I think another thing would be communication. Hmm. We, we talk. 
and uh, talks yeah, we 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 not just it's not I talk <laughs> too much. <laughs> <laughs> we it's not just a, a husband wife relationship. It's 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 friendship. It's a friend. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. She's a friend, and whenever I have issues, she's the first person I think about. Mm. I mean, whether whatever the problem is, and I've always told her if ever I get to that point where. I have a problem and you don't come to my mind first, mm. then I think I have a problem or there is a problem. Wow. Yes. Wow. So wow. I think that's what a relationship should be, mm. a husband and wife relationship. Show some love, man. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Wow. Well, folks listening at home, and I'm sure you have learned so much. It's an amazing relationship, amazing friendship, yeah. you know. And, and I, was it a sticker that I saw somewhere that the best situation you can be in is to marry your friend, mm. yeah. you know, someone who's a friend. And you guys are yes. splendid friends, friends, man. Yeah, yeah. Give it up for them again one more time. Yeah. <laughs> the friends argue a lot too, you know. They do. <laughs> and they resolve it. They resolve it. They resolve it. <laughs> Anything coming up movie-wise that we should look out for? Um, movie-wise, yes. Um, I, I, let me talk about the movie I just did in um, Liberia. Liberia. Okay. It's called Providence. Okay. It's, it's a historical um, drama. And I think that would be huge because we had um, the director was from this is a Hollywood director, okay. um, Bob Ra um, Roger Bob, mm -hmm. and uh, he came down with Lisa Wu, uh, a few Hollywood actors, mm. and I co-produced it. I co-directed oh, with with Roger, wow. and I co-wrote, and what else? And I starred in it as well. Fantastic. I think it's going to be a big one. The market is it's it's for the it's it's like for um, U.S. television. Uh, we don't know about the cinemas yet, but for mm -hmm. sure U.S. television, mm. and we, we're going to put it in um, several festivals. I Fantastic. think that for me is my that biggest is project. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Yeah. I must say, I invited um, 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 actors who are connected to Liberia as well. So Juliet Ibrahim was in it. Okay. Jose Tolbert yeah, was in it. Yeah, I think I read it. something. something yes. yeah. um, um, Eddie Watson was in it. Um, Chi Chi myself the only person who we didn't get in it was uh, frank atus i think he was busy at the time mm -hmm. but i was glad that i had a lot of these um stars fantastic. being filmed fantastic it will be an amazing one it will be an amazing one and congratulations Thank man you. Thank you. That's, that's i guess i don't know a chuckle <laughs> 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 <Check. laughs> <laughs> just one more time and van as well she's my accountant she's your accountant <laughs> yes you know the deal, man. Yes. I know where the money is. You know where the money is, man. <laughs> he doesn't have to show you the money. You count the money. Yes, yeah. exactly. And, and I come begging for some. And you come begging for some. <laughs> My count is this. I give you the cash, you keep it, yeah. and then when I need it, you come for can it. I get some? Wait, what are you going to use it for? And then I get all the questions. Do you what do you need it? Do you need it? <laughs> Why? Yeah. <laughs> we're able to give and, all the answers. And let me say, since we're in the month of love and you're talking about how a relationship can last, yeah. I yeah. think one of the things people need to watch out for is uh, money, money issues. Mm. I think if you can be very transparent mm. when it comes to money mm. issues, it mm. helps. Mm. You see, that for us, there's no such thing as your money, my money. Mm. It's, it's our, our money. money. So she makes, I make, we put the budget together. Do we plan what we want to do. We bank the rest. So there is no, I'm hiding a little here on the yeah. side for whatever purposes. And I, I think money, it's key. Mm -hmm. If you can share it and keep it together mm. without um, hidden agendas because you want to use some for whatever, yeah. it, it's, it, it's something that can really keep you close yeah. to each other. Okay. And, and that has been it for years. Wow. Shut some love, man. That's a free... Very, very, very important yeah. tip for you, Murray, guys, from the man, Van. You the man. No, you the man. No, I was the man. You're still the man. <laughs> I'll be the man. Oh. Be the man. <laughs> Since we don't know, you'll be, you be the man. <laughs> Stick around, folks. We'll be right back. If you reach for that remote, I will bite you. The KSM Show will be right back.